Hey YouTube, it's uh, BC13 guys here. I'm gonna be teaching you how to re get your iPod started, reboot it. Um, because say you just installed Winterboard and you messed up. Well, you, you didn't mess up. It had a reboot. Now nothing's happening. What the heck? Well, this is the Cywood side of it. Your Cywood jailbreak helper. This is how you do it with this. Go to step five. If you want to see an easier way with the one-click boot option, just go to my other video, and that'll explain the one-click boot. This may be quicker, I don't know. I really think they're just about the same. But one boot, one-click boot, you have to do less. Okay, so what we're going to do here says put your iPod into DFU mode. So you're going to hold the home and power button for 10 seconds. Then there's the chime. Now you're just gonna hold the home button for ten for eight seconds. So you hear another time. Okay, now you're gonna upload the DFU patch. You're gonna unplug your cord for two seconds and plug it back in. Your screen is gonna go white. And what that means there is now that you're gonna oh now you're gonna upload. Hang on, let me close lower iTunes. Now you have to upload the own patch bin and do next step. Now you're gonna click the press me, you're gonna right click right here next to iPhone and hit paste. And as you can see here it's gonna do all its stuff. Your screen will still be white. Just one second, let it finish. Okay, there, it's done. So now what you're going to do is hit next step. Now right here you're going to hit upload patch DFU. And the enter go, you're going to type in go slash exit upload patch image file. And right here you're going to type in, oops, hang on. Right here you're going to type in go. Your iPod's going to shut off and reboot. And then you're just going to type in slash exit. Your iPod should be rebooting now. And, as you can see in iTunes right here, it lost the iPod. And, one second. You probably, I don't know if you could hear it through the computer microphone, but my iPod just beeped, saying that it was connected to the computer. But what should happen now is your I the iPod part that should have went over there, there with no name, should have disappeared, and now soon your iPod will start syncing to iTunes, and your thing should show up there. Just, my iTunes is a little bit slow, so, you know, it takes a while. It takes a little while. So, yeah, there it is. So, there you go. That's how you reboot it from Sidewood. Please check out my other video. Subscribe. Request me as a friend. Subscribe. Do whatever. Thanks, YouTube. Bye. Uh, special thanks to Wilta Team, Wilta Team Productions, and WiltaTeam.com. Special thanks to the iPod Dev Team, and I mean the iPhone Dev Team, and the makers of the Cywood Jailbreak. Thanks.